news, Nigerians. Igbo community in Finland demands proof and trial of Simeon Ekba over killings in southeast Nigeria. Sahara reporters report. They called on the Finnish government to retain the separatist leader, adding that there was no place on the planet where people could simply hide inside violence and escape punishment. Hi guys, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for always coming out here. If you have not subscribed, please kindly do. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. This one is another one reaching us right now. That uh, Igbo community in Finland demands proof and trial of Simeon Ekba over killings in the southeast Nigeria. They called on the Finnish government to restrain the separatist leader, adding that there were no place. There was no place on the planet where people could simply hide inside violence and escape judgment. The Igbo community in Finland has decried the seditious statement of Simeon Ekbar, the self-proclaimed head of autopilot indigenous peoples of Biafra, IPOP, residing in Lahu, Finland. They called on the Finnish government to restrain the separatist leader, adding that there were no place on the planet where people could simply hide inside violence and escape punishment. The Igbo community in in statement signed by one Kingsley OJ called for both governments of Finland and Nigeria to commence immediate investigation of Prince Ekpa with a view of bringing him to face the full wrath of the law. The statement said the Igbo community in Finland had convened a meeting on December 18, 2022, to discuss the escalating crisis in Nigeria's southeast region. According to the statement, Iqbal was present at the meeting, which afforded the attend atten attendees opportunities to ask him some basic questions. The prominent among the issues discussed was the recent first five day sit at home order issued by Iqbal the illegally imposed and ruthlessly enforced order called incomprehensibly economic mystery and diversification to lives and property causing significant anxiety among the southeast population the, dis the discussion also addressed its ongoing vicious incitement that no elections on political gathering we hold in the southeast geopolitical zone of nigeria a pronouncement that constitutes a cross breach of the people's fundamental human rights to assemble and vote why we respect and recognize the rights of individual to express their thoughts the igbo community in finland strongly denounces simeon ekbar's seducer statement and actions which have taken on a dangerously violent dimension of killing and devastation whenever he issues such directives due to his threats and the violent actions of his group in southeast Nigeria. There is a high level of insecurity in Igbo territory, which makes it hard to travel to do business. Consequent upon the foregoing, the Igbo community in Femland is openly and strongly condemning Simeon Iqbal's violent method of operation and wishes to state our position as follows, that we reject every illegal state at home order or any other orders that restrict the economic activity and daily lives of people as criminal elements have exploited such others to kill, to steal, and destroy properties in Igbo land. That we strongly urge Mr. Simeon Ekba to recite his own diplomatic campaign slogan that there will be no election in Biafra land in 2023, and seeks all his efforts to deprive Igbos of the opportunity 
and the right to vote and participate in the political process of electing their leaders. That Simeon Ekpa be warned strongly not to use social media to spread threats of violence, which is making the Igbo people of Nigeria angry. There is no place on the planet where people can simply hide, inside violence and escape punishment. Therefore, the Igbo community in Finland is calling for action as follows. That Simeon Ekpa be immediately restrained, investigated and made to face the full rot of the law, both in Finland and in Nigeria. Based on Belgian law on universal jurisdiction, that the Finnish authorities should take jurisdiction rights away and stop Mr. Simeon Ekpa from continuing to incite violence against life and people, murder of any kind, mortilation and violations of the right to, people, to life, that all relevant authorities should deploy all diplomatic channels to ensure that Mr. Simeon Ekpa and his group are prevented from causing further damages, the statement added. Meanwhile, Nigerians have this to say. Nda Bakele Kesef. Dave Omai killing innocent Iboi with Ibubago. This Ekpa in Femland recruit his town boys destroying Igbo land, especially Anambra State. It's unacceptable that Ekpa must be brought to justice for crimes committed against humanity in Igbo land. Simeon remains the 50% of the 100 men needed by Mazin Namdekanu. It is very wrong to deny one of your comrades, not even at this needed time. This guy is fighting for Igbo's freedom and you are outside there saying another thing. Step in the right direction. Igba must face the law for innocent lives he wasted in Southeast on the name of Sita Tom. Someone said they allow the common criminal to grow wings to the point of killing our people under the guise of a government sponsored Sita Tom. The so called Igbo community in Femland, what did what did they do since Onyendo Mazinam de Kano is in illegal detention in DSS office in Nigeria? They must they shall, they shall go and sit down, okay? They should go and sit down, okay? I believe that is what I wanted to say. So, guys, these are reactions by Nigerians. Let's hear from you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Igbo community in Femland demands probe and trial of Simeon Ekpa over killings in Southeast Nigeria. So guys, what's your take? Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you for always listening. <music>